Hey guys, it's Ford and welcome back to another awesome toy review. This one's be a little bit different. We got some awesome vintage stuff to review today. Jurassic Park, The Lost World, 1997 toys, along with uh, maybe uh, some Jurassic Park toys just in general. Guys, smack the like button, subscribe, the notification bell, turn on so you're missing an upload. I'm doing a huge giveaway at 10k subscribers, so make sure you stay to the end of the video to know how to enter giveaways. Anyway. So I want to show you guys some stuff before I get into what I have today. I want to show you guys some extra stuff that I have that I haven't been able to show you guys. So first up, this is a while ago. I had this from a while ago. I just found it recently. This is an awesome looking Brachiosaurus that I got um, in an Animal Planet bucket back in like 2005. And uh, yeah, I want to show you guys this. I know it's not Jurassic Park related, but it killed two birds with one stone when it comes to these videos. Also, I want to show you something that's very rare that I love to death. Um, you guys know that I love dinosaurs and just, you know, animals in general, along with, you know, a bunch of other stuff. But this is the awesome Dinosaurus from Dino Valley, the Dino Valley line. And this Dinosaurus is absolutely amazing. I love, this is my childhood one that I got with, uh, I have the original figure and the original truck as well. Um, and if you move its arm, his jaw moves. I can't tell you how many times I have used this Spinosaurus. It is so awesome. Now let's get to the vintage stuff, shall we? All right, here we go. I believe this is from the Jurassic Park Lost World. Uh, because here we are. The baby T-Rex with the broken leg, which you can break yourself. Just like so. Pretty awesome. It's supposed to come with like a little, uh bandage here but I'll show you guys that in a second so you can break his leg you can twist it like that pretend it's broken like they did in the movie they broke uh, the baby T-Rex's leg um, in Jurassic Park The Lost World to lure the mama T-Rex to capture the mama T-Rex um, but I love the the detail on the face really ain't that bad it's pretty awesome they got the mouth now I believe it's supposed to come with a muzzle as well put over his mouth I'm most certain it does but this is like the brown t-rex baby t-rex very cool and up next we have blue baby t-rex this one I recently just got from eBay um, absolutely love the colors this is definitely going on my display along with this one this is my childhood one um, this one is not. This one I've never had or owned before, and I love the blue. I don't know if it's part of the chaos effect. I highly doubt it, but maybe it's just a blue variant. I don't know. But still very awesome. Love the uh, red eyes along with the blue skin. Same face scan, same detail when it comes to that. Um, I definitely recommend this figure. This is, uh, I love it. I love the blue. It's just so cool. Um, and this is a little bandage thing I was talking about. Now you can go ahead and pop this out um, if needed. Um, I don't like to pull it out because it's a pain in the butt to get back in. But this hole right here is where you put this little bandage in, this little cast in. So, very cool. Love it so far. Next up, this is from my collection, my childhood collection, uh, that I've never, I don't believe I've shown this on camera. This is from Jurassic Park 3. And it is a awesome Brachiosaurus. It's got like a, his head... His neck can kind of move. It's like, kind of like a rubber, kind of move around a little bit. There's no wire in it, so it's not going to stay there. But uh, it's supposed to make some sound effect, but if you listen, it you could barely, barely hear it, but it is there. Um, his leg is supposed to move, and it's supposed to move his tail. But if you notice, his leg doesn't move, or his leg moves, but the tail kind of moves a little bit. But if you move the tail... Just like though his leg will start to move. So that's pretty cool. Very cool toy. Very old toy. There we go. Perfect size. And now let's go ahead and get into what I really wanted to show you guys today. The Allosaurus Rehabilitation Playset. Oh my god. From 1997 Jurassic Park The Lost World. I can't wait to show you guys this. Um, I am missing three pieces. Only three of the tools. That's all I'm missing. Alright, so here we go. We have the bottom piece of this uh, Jurassic World, or Jurassic Park, the Lost World Rehabilitation Playset. We have, there it is, Jurassic Park, the Lost World right there, the logo. Very cool. Very awesome. So here's the uh, 
kind of like the operation table for the dinosaur. And of course, so we have all these pieces right here. And I'll show you guys what goes in what. So this right here is kind of like the, uh, where it keeps the, I, I guess this is just uh, the IV to give blood. Um, it's cool because it's got, well, this thing comes out. But it looks like there's actual blood in there. And like if you tip it over, you can kind of see where it looks like it's dripping down. Because there's actual fluid in here and liquid. So, this looks pretty cool. This goes right in here like so. Just like that, and it stays in there pretty well. This piece, obviously it holds the blood jar or tank, whatever you want to call it. This goes right back here. Because this is where the dinosaur or okay, the allosaurus head is going to be laying. This right here is just the uh, strap to hold the dinosaur down. It can either go right here, right here, right here. Or right up here to hold its head. So four different spots. I always just keep it right here. And this is like the computer and the data and where all that other stuff. It's like a whole table. This is where the three tools are supposed to go. But again, I do not have the tools, so I do have to buy those. Other than that, then it'll be complete. Um, very rare set to get. Uh, very amazing set to get. So this goes right here in the corner just goes in there just like so and that's another thing I love about the Kenner uh, line and all the old Jurassic Park toys they're very easy to put together they're all plastic and they're very good quality so here's the uh, piece that holds like the tail of the dinosaur that goes right here BAM didn't even need directions to set this bad boy up it was so easy and last but certainly not least the best part of this video the part that I've been waiting for is the amazing Jurassic Park the Lost World Allosaurus figure um, with four points of dino damage the most dino damage in any Jurassic Park toy so you have the Allosaurus this face scan absolutely amazing it looks really beautiful for an older toy they did an amazing job on the sculpt of this dinosaur uh, arms do move up and down his legs do move and of course you guys want to see that dino damage so here we go first part of dino damage you can take part of his leg right off you can take part of his tail right off now they're all rubber pieces and they do fit in very well just like the uh, Jurassic Park first the first movie it's all rubber and you know the pieces come right off and as you can see they're molded so it'll stick right back on and we also have the part of the rib cage oh look at that ribs came right out in the piece so that is the whole play set I mean absolutely amazing I mean that's kind of gruesome that's a little violent but still very cool and that's the best part you know that's just so awesome like just the detail and how you could take the dinosaur apart it's just so cool so you can go ahead and put your dinosaur your allosaurus right here his tail fit right in there and you can go ahead and strap the bad boy right in now it worked off camera now let's see if it, there we go perfect now he's all strapped in and there we go now that is an amazing play set so got now originally obviously it doesn't come with any figures, but I had to put that there just for you know. But still very awesome. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Oh wait a minute, one more thing I had to show that I haven't showed yet. The 1993 Jurassic Park Jeep. Now again, this is not complete. I forget. I can't believe how big this truck is. To be honest with you, um, I thought it was gonna be a lot smaller, especially compared to the newer figures up here. The Jeep is a lot smaller, along with the figures are a lot tinier like it's a lot smaller compared to the older figures but very cool I love the detail I love the, the stickers on the side love the old Jurassic Park logo this comes up so you can put your figure inside and again it's not complete but you know it, they're really expensive as they are complete um, you can lift this bad boy right up and you can actually shoot the missile that it comes with right there 
Let's see if I can get this out for you guys. So you go ahead and you have the missile. You're gonna stick it straight in there. Like so. Now it's ready to launch. And now we can fire it. Just like so. Very awesome. Also, before I go, guys, anybody let me know in the comment section below what this is. It came with this truck from eBay. And I would like to know what the hell this is. If you guys could tell me, that would be great because I'm new to all. Well, I'm kind of newish to the the uh, vehicles from the older movies. So. That was my Jurassic Park Vintage Toy Lot and review. Well, and some extra, obviously. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, smack the like button and subscribe. Now, for 10 of the giveaway at 10K subscribers, I promised you all that I would do a huge giveaway with 10 big animal buckets from Adventure Force, and I'm going to go ahead and do that. But before I do, I want to lay down a couple of rules so everybody understands what to do. You must smash the like button. You must be subscribed to both channels with the notification bell turned on. You must comment in the comment section below and watch my videos from start to finish. There you go. You automatically enter the giveaway. You must be present in the live stream of the giveaway in order to win as well. I can't give away anything to anybody if I can't contact them or tell them that they have won. So there you go. And if you beg ask for figures or demand for figures or you be mean to me or any other subscribers or be a poor sport in the comment section you'll be disqualified from the giveaway it's just the way it is i can't give something away to somebody if they're being mean and rude etc so guys there you go there you have it i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did smack the like button subscribe and you guys don't forget to stay awesome see you guys later and oh i am so excited to add all this to my collection